Hello and welcome to this video brought to you by HowToMF.com. This is Steven here, and in this video I will be showing you how to kill a process with a bat batch file. Now to get started, what you need to do is open up Notepad, just the basic text editor. Maximize it, and click File, Save As. Make sure you save it to your desktop, and type in test, or whatever you want to call it, dot bat make sure you type in dot period bat if you do not do that it will not save it as a batch file there it is and then what you need to do first off you need to type in at echo off um, give it a couple spaces and type in task kill forward slash f space forward slash i am this means image name this designates the command and then open up your uh, your task manager and then just go through here type in just look for a process and look at the image name. Just look for just look for a process you might want to close. Um, I'm just going to type in Notepad as an example. Notepad.exe. Make sure you add the exe. And after that, type in pods. Um, you can do this with more than one. You could have as many as you want. You could have 200 take a while but it would work um, I don't think you'd ever have 200 processes at once on your computer but it'd work alright make sure you save it just kinda close just kinda um, maximize it or minimize it I'll drag in another one and then double click on the batch file boom boom it'll give you the process quotes notepad.exe with PID for 308 don't really be don't really need to pay attention about that and this is, has been terminated press any key to continue um if you want it to close on its own what you would do is type in ex exit file save and it exits command prompt on its own simple helpful if your computer starts up and you have un unwanted um processes that you just don't want to close one by one you can do that that's what i do uh hopefully this helped thank you for watching and have a nice day